It's the essence of American citizenship, owning land and doing about what you please on it. To Kingwood resident Russell Oaks, that means shooting guns on his property as he has for years. We've been doing it openly and knowingly for 15 years and three years since the park opened. And quite frankly, I don't know why we're even here discussing it other than the fact that there's some other motives that the township has and not the state, the township. Uh, so three years ago, Kingwood Township bought most of the land surrounding Russell Oaks property and that land's now public park. And Mayor Philip Lovett says that Oaks ought to cease fire. You know, conditions change. And as a result of that, you know, uh, the way you approach your land has to change as well. Oaks has put up signs to warn park goers that he does have a range on his property. Mayor Lovett says that Oaks did it prior to an equestrian event in the park with an intent to scare people. He chose this day to post this sign. You know, we can only see it as a further escalation and uh, really meant to intimidate. Now, Oaks says he was just being responsible. Shouldn't people know, he asks? Lovett says he's waiting on word from the state police on the status of Oaks's range. Oaks says he's heard from the state police and from the deputy attorney general's office, and he's building a U-shaped berm around the target area on his range, and then he says the cops are fine with that. Is anybody indicating or questioning that there's, there's potential of danger, so a park goer getting shot, or is the range contained uh, to begin with? It all depends on who you ask. There's been a trail that the township uh, sort of plowed or, or mowed that goes right behind the range. Was the trail there several years ago? Oak says it doesn't show up on the maps. So he says that they put a, a trail right there by the range in order to sort of facilitate this conflict. This guy already owned that land. They already knew that he was, sh he was shooting on his land. So public safety, I mean, that's bogus. My question is, why is, who is there to resolve the conflict between the state police saying it's okay and the township saying it's not? At some point, who's the arbiter of this? I mean, will this end up in the courts? Where does it go next? Well, it's ongoing. I'm reaching out to the state police to find out exactly where it stands because, again, the mayor says he's waiting to hear back from the state police. Russell says state police are okay with him building a berm around it. So you got two different accounts there, uh, and the state police haven't gotten back to me on it yet.